In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to easily create t-shirts and sticker designs here using Ideogram. Now what I'm going to do is share with you my prompt structure so it makes everything so much easier. So if we click on one of these, let's go ahead and take a look at this. This is the prompt which I use. Now what I'm going to do is also leave this down in the description. But if we take this, let's plug that up here, let's put that in there. Make sure that you're on 1.0 if you're going to use Ideogram for the best results. But right here is the prompt structure. So at the beginning, this is where we can change things out. So at the minute, it says sticker design. If I want to create a t-shirt, all we have to do is change sticker to t-shirt. Then right here is where I describe what I want. So let's plug that in there like this, it brackets, and this is where we're going to describe what you want. Then I have with the words. So if you want text on your design, we're going to have that along with brackets. So right here, this is where you're going to put the phrase that you want. Then I have flat bright colors isolated on a white background. So this is the prompt structure again, which I've been using for the last couple of days. We can change out t-shirt for sticker and you're going to get a completely different design. Then we're going to describe what we want. And then if we want text, we're going to put that in here along with flat bright colors isolated on a white background. And again, I'm going to leave this down in the description. Now when using this, what we want to use is also illustration just there. So let's go ahead and put t-shirt design, cartoon happy kawaii sloth, with the words, and let's put some words in here. Don't worry, be happy, flat bright colors, isolated on a white background. We've got illustration enabled as well. We're going to do 1.0 and we're going to use magic prompt. Now what magic prompt does will make your original prompt even better. So right here on the right hand side, we can see my original prompt just here, and then using magic prompt, it turned that into this longer prompt just here. But now we're going to click generate. It's going to generate this. It's also going to give us four variations of that design as well. And there we go. We can see the first one messed up the writing just a little bit with BB. But then this one, don't worry, be happy, looks perfect. Same with this one. But the problem is these two quite look like a sticker design, whereas this one looks more like the t-shirt design. And that's spot on. Don't worry, be happy. But if we click on here, we can see the original prompt just there, and we can see the prompt that it actually created. But that's just how easy it is to create t-shirt designs and sticker designs using Ideogram. Now, if you found this video helpful at all, then please consider giving me a like, as it really helps out the channel. And if you're not too sure what to watch next, click right here and watch this playlist.